Hey there crafty cuties. If you're new, I'm Jessica. And welcome to Paper Terrace. Uh, last time that I did a video like this where I just showed you a box of 100 postcards, you guys seem to really like it. And I was just doing that as a test because it's such a simple video. So I almost wasn't going to do it, but then I went ahead and looked at that last video and you guys liked it. So here I am again. And I just love the prints that we are going to look at and so there are a hundred postcards and I could not find anything um, saying if they're all 100 different usually that's the case so I'm gonna think yes now these are designs by um, sorry I have it next to me here William Morris I'm not familiar with him but as I was searching for postcard packs I just love the designs and I feel like I've bought some fabric that was designed by this artist but I don't know and if you're wondering why I need 100 postcards every month I use them for my Patreon members every month I send out happy mail to my Patreon members even the $5 a month tier so if you're wondering more about my Patreon you can check below but maybe you're someone who buys a lot of postcards. I don't know. I'm doing a video coming up soon also sharing different ideas how you can use postcards in your journals. Okay, finally, let's get into it. I'm just going to flip through and show you the different postcards. So yeah, these prints, um, I think I read that they are different wallpaper, textile, and tile designs, which, it, which explains why I like them so much because I love working with like wallpapers a lot and so yeah um, my camera doesn't want to focus on these but gosh I'm as always when I usually buy these postcard packs I have a hard time giving them up oh my gosh like this this is gorgeous like I don't know why I love that but I love how it has two different designs these are so pretty so yeah I'm really excited and I, I was kind of looking for more of a watercolory design because this month I am including handmade journal cards that I am stamping and watercoloring. Here's like an idea if you're wondering. Um, the different tiers get different amounts of things for my Patreon members but I always want a postcard that maybe kind of goes with the theme. I couldn't find watercolor but when I saw these I just felt like it was exactly the right feel that I was going for. Man, my hands are freezing right now. It's probably like 40 degrees at the most and I just got done playing outside with my kids on the trampoline. So pretty. I just love how different these are, but they're just really cool. And I feel like with most postcard packs that I buy, there's always a handful that I don't like love. I still like them, but I don't love them. But I absolutely love each and every one of these. Like I could use these. These would be such pretty journal covers. You could either do a small journal like this size and have this be the full cover, or you could just place it on top of a journal that's bigger and maybe have like some fabric in the background or wallpaper. I think this is the one that was on the box and I really liked that. These are really matte also, and a lot of postcards that I get are glossy, which that just kind of comes along with postcards. So I think that's another thing that I'm loving. I really like that they are matte. And so these would work really well for journals because of that. A lot of people don't love working with glossy. There's a tiny bug floating around right now. So sorry if he comes on through. This is cool. This actually looks like fabric in real life. I don't even know if you'll be able to tell on camera. It looks very textured. Yeah, something, oh, like these colors, something about these colors, like this just inspires me. This makes me want to make a journal with a bunch of these, like that would be so fun to use like these as the journal cover and then have these also be the pages, like, yeah, I'm imagining that. I actually for sure will be using um, the little box that came in. I don't usually use the boxes because it usually has like words on it. But this one doesn't. 
So let me know, like I think I could make this into a journal cover. Um, I'll have to figure out, that this one's very sturdy, so I will have to figure out taking off the little box part, but I'm certain I can figure it out. So let me know what would you use postcards for, or if you're watching this video, you must be interested in some way. If I have that video up sharing the different ways and ideas that you can use postcards in your journals, I will definitely link it below for you. This is, I like how this is like mostly green and then you have just little pop blue, little pop of like peach color. So I'm curious if these are actually like wallpaper, if he also has, or I don't know, if he's like known for wallpaper maybe, like that would make sense because it said that these were wallpaper designs. So I guess probably, right? Oh, that one's pretty. It just seems so dainty. <gasps> oh man, so we're actually looking to buy a house in this year probably maybe not very soon but so if these were really wallpapers that's cool on its own um dang it would be cool to do a room with wallpaper some of this wallpaper i'm hoping that we find a house with a basement i just saw one and it had a full basement with rooms in it and stuff and it would be my craft studio so I'm so excited for that. I mean, like I said, it's probably not going to be anytime soon. It's a long process here in Portland, Oregon, because you have to spend half a million to get a house at least, at least. <laughs> but, but I'm dreaming and I'm thinking about it. Okay, almost, almost through here. I will have the link below as always. I get them from Amazon, so it is an Amazon affiliate link. I get a tiny commission from that if you use my link, and I absolutely appreciate when you guys use my links because I can use that extra money to basically buy more crafty things to make more videos. That's really what it goes into, but I appreciate it. And if you don't want to use my affiliate link, that's totally fine too. You can absolutely use my link to find what it's called and then, you know, look it up for yourself. So. That's what you would do if you didn't want to use my link. I'd, I mean, I feel like if you're watching my videos, you're probably fine with supporting me. But I know there are some people that maybe just wouldn't want to do that. Because <laughs> that's how it goes. Being on the internet. Oh, so cool. Yeah, these were awesome. So anyways, guys, yeah, if you have any questions or... I'm not sure. These are so cool. I hope that I can find more that are similar to this. Because I definitely would love to but thank you guys for coming along for such a simple video and if you want more information on my patreon if you want to see how you can get some things like these oh i like how these look in the camera i'm excited i have to do like 90 more of these <laughs> but if i i lately i've had some spots open so i probably have spots open now again this is going to be for february so if you're watching this anytime after February then the items I'm sending out will be different but I always strive to have cool things I'm sending out so uh, yeah just leave any questions down below you can message me on patreon if you have a question about it and I'll see you guys in the next video bye